So a couple of weeks ago, we made a video on the channel about a harvesting glitch that was actually pretty insane. Pretty much made your pickaxe just swing at 3,000 miles per second. So you would harvest a lot quicker, break materials, whether it was wood, brick, or metal, a lot quicker. Unfortunately for that glitch, it only worked on Soaring 50s, and of course, Soaring 50s is no longer a game mode that we have available to us. Now, this glitch contains uh, a llama, and you actually being able to triple your loot, no matter what it is, whether it's bullets, materials, it triples everything if you get a llama. Now, there's a certain thing you have to do, and I haven't done it myself, so I'm going to go into Playgrounds mode, and I've seen that it works on Playground, and I've also seen that it works in a regular mode like Solo Duels or Squads. Now, the reason we're going to do this on Playgrounds is because... Llamas are a lot more common to find in playgrounds as opposed to in an actual game. This is something that you can use honestly when you're playing 1v1s or just messing around in playgrounds with your friends. It's going to be very, very useful if you want to get shields or whatnot. Sometimes in playgrounds, you're in a specific area for a long time. And once you run out of shields, that's pretty much it. So you can try and do this to get a couple of extra shields. I don't know if it's going to work when the new update comes out. Because as you guys know, some of the items are going to be upped as far as how much you can hold per slot. So again, during this update, it might actually be patched. Pretty much what we're going to do is find a llama here and see if this actually works. So pretty much I just want to find out for myself, test it myself, and of course pretty much confirm it here with you guys. And you guys can see that it works. Or if it doesn't, hopefully it does, because if not, this would have been a really big waste of time. So the first thing is first, we got to find a llama, because this glitch pertains a llama and one of those new shockwave grenades. So... Here's a llama. Let's break it. Don't be a noob. Just break it instead of searching it. Okay. We don't have anything here. So pretty much, I'm just going to show you what you get for the llama. Okay. It's pretty much 200, 200 materials. I'm going to keep searching another llama just because I need to make sure that I can find myself that new shockwave grenade. And I would assume that the shockwave grenade could be found in a llama out of everything in the game. Now, you may be wondering, well, an impulse grenade is pretty much the same thing as a shockwave grenade why doesn't it work for those of you that didn't know or just probably haven't noticed the shockwave grenade has this little after effect that the impulse just simply doesn't and that's pretty much it it actually destroys anything that you throw it at so it can destroy uh materials etc etc the impulse grenade does not do that finally jesus look at this 36 i've been on the lookout for this thing for 30 minutes <laughs> almost 30 minutes but anyways, here's what we're going to do for the purpose of this video. That's all my loot right there. I just need to take this one shockwave grenade back. And um, we don't have anything. As you can see, we're empty. We're going to go find another llama. Here we go. Okay, well, that failed. I'm thinking it's because I, I didn't hit the llama. You're supposed, to <laughs> you're supposed to throw the shockwave grenade and hit the llama. Okay, so let's uh, let's do this again. All right, there we go pile of stuff here we go there we go look at that look at that 600 wood 600 materials 600 bricks it just gave us more than what the llama normally would give us in the beginning unfortunately i hit the llama towards the top so i i didn't hit it high enough where i would have gotten all my stuff like obviously the mech kits the 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 slurp juices and Stuff like that. So we're going to try this again. Let's get rid of all my mats. Just so you guys know, llamas do not give you more materials in playground um, than in the regular mode. It's the same thing. So here we go. All right. I hit it, but I only got the wood. And as you can see, it's 600 wood. Look at the shotgun shells, 120. A regular llama does not give you 120. Okay, it just doesn't. Unfortunately, I am so terrible at this that I cannot hit a llama straight on. Pretty fucking sad. There we go. We did it. But slightly. We only did it slightly. But as you can see, if you manage to hit the llama correctly... <laughs> I'm such a fucking noob. If you manage to hit the llama correctly, it will give you multiple materials. Okay? As far as bullets and everything else, take a look at these bullets. 180, 540, 540, and 120. All you have to do is hit the llama with the shockwave grenade and pretty much launch yourself forward and hit it and get everything as you're being launched by the shockwave grenade. So again, 180, 540, 540, 120. That's for the bullets. Thankfully, we have another llama here just so you guys can see that it does not give you that much amount of materials or bullets for that matter. 
So you guys don't think that it's only in playgrounds or whatever. Llamas give you the same thing no matter where you're at. Check the bullets. The bullets are 60, 180, 180, and 40. This was like 120, I think, uh, 540, 540, and another 120. So everything literally pretty much gets multiplied. Everything inside the llama gets multiplied. I'll go back to this loot, which is pretty much where we just were. And as you can see, 180, 540, 120 for shotgun shells. It's pretty much, it multiplies drastically. Look. I'll get it all. 180, 540, 540, 120. This is the loot that we had, and, and of course the material, 600. So pretty much everything triples, okay? Everything that you get just triples. Now, if it stays on the floor, if you pick it up and you drop it on the floor, it, it will not leave. It'll stay like that as far as materials go. All right, so that one, we pretty much got everything. Of course, you may want to press square, depending on your console, just so you can pick up all the other stuff like shields and shit, because it's not gonna give it to you automatically. This glitch is absolutely insane, and it works both in playgrounds and in the regular mode. I mean, it's really rare for you to come across a llama regardless, but just in case, so you have it in mind, if you have a llama and you happen to see a shockwave grenade, wait for it, you know? Like, wait for it, because it's worth it. Again, all you have to do is break the llama while hitting your character from the impact of the shockwave grenade, and you should be able to get everything. It doesn't matter if you pick it up or not, you still should get everything. You pretty much just have to break the llama with the shockwave grenade. I'm gonna test it out real quick, see if you just throw the, the shockwave grenade at it. It doesn't work. Your body has to be right here. Your body has to be right there with it. How crazy is that? Well, we just confirmed something. 600 materials. Well, there you guys have it. I know it's kind of like a weird glitch, and it's something that works against solo duels and squads. doesn't matter which mode. And on top of that, on playgrounds, there's so many of you guys that I know that it has to happen to some of you at some point where you have a brand new shockwave, and you see a llama, and you want to pick it up, and you want to pretty much take advantage of this glitch. I don't know how much longer it's going to be in the game for. Let me know what you think. I hope you found this video somewhat useful or informative, or maybe it'll help you in some scenarios a lot of the times. The main reason I'm posting this video is because it sucks that the llamas are nerfed, the materials are nerfed, Everything that revolves materials and harvesting in this game has been nerfed. If you've been playing it for a long time, you know how drastically it's gotten nerfed. Not more than once, multiple times. So I thought this might be a nice little incentive for you guys that are, um, you know, trying to steal a couple more mats here and there. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave it a like. As always, catch you later. <laughs>